guys, it's Aaron, your personal coach. Welcome to my tip number five, corrections at the desk. Now, this one is for the rotator cuffs. You've got two rotator cuffs, infraspinatus and supraspinatus that comes in here. Sometimes these guys get tight because we're at the computer as well. Um, so, um, so what we're going to do is the hand will just go behind the back here like that, simply like that. You push the hand into the back. Now from here, just seated at your desk, you want to retract the shoulder back, right? Now, so what you want to do, you can either grab the hand over here and pull that, a light, gentle stretch, and just hold that for 10 to 20 seconds, right, as you push the hand into the back as well, right? You'll feel that tightness, that pain. And if you're super tight here, you won't actually be able to grab that, right? Because you'll be so far back here, you won't be able to reach, that's fine. All you've got to do is just retract and push that hand into the back, you'll still feel the stretch. But if you want to just intensify it a little bit more, the hand comes on the back here, push that hand in and away you go. Other side, remember 10 to 20, hand here, shoulder back, Draw the belly button in, chest up tall, nice. Always, all these exercises keep a nice straight spine. I'll just stand up and show you here and I'll give you a little bit of a spin around how I'm doing it. Right, retract that shoulder back. That's how you want to be doing it. Just seated at your desk. Right, really, really good one. You can do that again. Two to five sets. You can just change, right, in between. In between. Your computer in between those other four tips that I've given you. So some like really great things that you can do to prevent any pain that you get from that office syndrome, right? Because it is ever so common, right? I get it. I sit at a computer for four hours straight. My neck hurts. My back hurts. I need to get up. I need to do these corrections, right? So it's not a natural position for us to be sitting down hunching the computer. So we need to do this type of stuff just to help correct the posture, um, and just reduce those tightness. But like most importantly, if you do get in the gym or you are doing exercise, it's going to be a lot safer so you don't create an injury. And even if you're not in the gym yet, you're still going to be preventing injuries, right? Injuries that you can just pick up a pen or if you're cleaning or gardening or anything like that, right? These exercises are fantastic for doing that, for uh, reducing all these tightnesses. Thanks so much for, for watching, guys. Like, don't forget my event coming up 28th of this month. The day in the gym for me, I'm going to be teaching you through everything from uh, basics to advance in regard to strength, conditioning, posture. Um, I'm going to be going through all sorts of stuff, breaking it all down to give you some really great education, some information to give you the confidence to get, to get in the gym and, and start um, losing out of the weight that you wanted to. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day. Bye.